crazy. Ano na naman to? I'm just going with the flow. Um, we have experts here. The design team. Of course, Joel. We have uh, the kitchen, of course. We have the team from Sarsa. That's Uncle Winston in orange. Setting up that. Then yung lounge ko, nakala ko ginawa ko na maganda. Ah, ayusin pa yan. Then this one, going to bar. Then ako, maliligo pa ako kasi kakagising ko lang. Then mamaya, bibis rin ako na medyo okay. Kasi idol pa to siya ako rin. May shorts rin ako na green. <laughs> Would you like a latte? Cappuccino? Yes, ma'am. Yes, please. Uh, is that a venti ice latte? It's <laughs> <laughs> okay. testing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, milk froth. And the famous Aaron shot. The eating or drinking shot. Frothy. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good morning, guys. Is this a surprise? Uh, this, this is uh, we we decided to bring the coffee machine. <laughs> oh my God! So adorable. Home be Bruce heading up. I call it our coffee machine. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Oh, <laughs> Just get wet. Wait, I'm looking for like a whole ass area. There's no flat area. And then, oh, then wait, it's babalik siya. Well, kasi ito, 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 Ah, uh, may dala akong batuan dito. Hinaluan ko lang. 'Yun. Ah, uh, pangsabaw-sabaw lang habang sa mga sa lahat na naghihintay kasi yung lunch natin ay it's gonna start around 3. It's 12 o'clock. So yeah, we have 3 hours. So we have 3 chefs or 4 plus me in the kitchen and then we'll start churning out food na. So dito si Job, uh, first time kami mag-ihaw ng isaw sa Land Cruiser. <laughs> Lagyan ko ng sabaw, ikaw magtutusok. Hindi, tusok mo dyan. Yan. So, this is <laughs> tusok-tusok the to fishball, pero with a little twist na may sigang. So, pwede naman, di ba? Pwede naman. So, again, ulitin ko, uh, sobrang dali lang siya gawin. Uh, may shrimp stock ka lang, tapos sinigang mix, chicken powder, Ah, ito. So, pag ginawa mo to, fish ball, chicken powder, sinigang mix, shrimp stock, onions, kamatis, yun lang. Guys, 
There's a fishball sinigang soup here. <laughs> Let's let Aaron try it. Kawawa naman si Aaron. <laughs> Abby, uh, uh, Keres uh, fishball? Uh, do you know two soup, two soup the fishball, right? Yeah. Right? And then, mm. I'll, oh, give you, I'll give you some mm, soup. Crab. So basically, it's a, it's a, like a seafood sinigang, but we use fishball instead. Mm. So you do your two soup, two soup. Then this mm. one. Mm. 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 Good. Mm. 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 Uh, we are having a lot of food for lunch. Uh, well, we have this slab of steak that we will cook with this beautiful red wine, Malbec, yeah. Argentinian wine. Malbec. And then we'll saute the mushrooms. With again with the red wine, Basta. So for now, we're just having the appetizer, which is a, a fishball sinigang soup, and then we will proceed to the lunch. So I'm just what I'm doing right now is I'm in, I'm just trimming the meat, and then maybe make this into another steak sandwich because it's beautiful with red wine, and then the the ha part of this meat I'll make it into a stew. I know sayang just to make into a stew, but let's just go all out. Strip line, I believe. Yeah. I'm, all this fat I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use for the stew. Dito sa set natin yung staff meal, wala na, hindi naka styro. Tawa ka, no? <laughs> Pag nag shoot kami ni Ninong Ray, tapos may staff meal kami, sabi namin, tabi nyo na yung staff meal kami na magluluto. Have you tried this? Okay, you should. Baby, Saul is not a beast now. Saul with a costume change. <laughs> My first parong, bro. Yeah, a, fa a fancy man. Yeah. As we say, Nux. Wow. <laughs> wow. Bon girls. So shy. So shy. So shy. My second. So I'll give the other one to you. Thank you! I will we'll scare it. It's really nice with uh, grilled uh, dishes. So that's why we chose Isao to start this beautiful afternoon. So a beautiful afternoon with good friends. Good food, good wine. Cheers. 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 Oh, they go. They go, they go. Cheers again. We did our best to pair everything with this beautiful Malbec. We start off with the isao. After this, we will have a sort of like a steak steak sandwich. Yeah. It's good with the isao. Yeah, yeah. Why? It no, because the, the wine substitutes the vinegar. So right. It gives a really nice acid. Uh -huh. So take a bite of your isao and then take a sip. Oh. Like, mm. Nice. This is perfect. Let's render the beef. Then it's an Dagdag ako ng red wine, ah.
Tapos, steak ulit. Dito. Okay na yan, ano? Balik natin yung... Balik natin yung... Um, butter. Ito nandito. Rosemary. Tapos, lagay ang red wine. Using the steak oil, with the, I'll cook the mushrooms. So I'm making like a steak sandwich that I'm cooking in red wine. Um, the oil from the steak, I'm using to cook the mushrooms. Then I just flavored it with uh, rosemary and salt. You want the flavors to be very distinct, so you get the taste of the red wine, the steak, the salt, the rosemary, the butter. That's it. Then mushrooms. This is a uh, quesum puti that we will top. So basically, it's like a cheese mushroom steak sandwich. Onions, bell pepper. High heat. by the river. <laughs> I use the trimmings of the of the sirloin and the fat because it's good and it's great with the red wine. The thing is we on the red. Our second course, wine pairing, Malbec, Terrassa from Argentina. It's really good with meat, with steak, anything grilled really. What we have here is a steak sandwich. Basically, that's been sautéed with um, red wine. Uh, we sautéed the mushrooms, the bell peppers, and even the steak, the actual meat. So the flavors you'll taste really are the red wine, the steak, the salt, and all the like the bell peppers, the cheese. We use quesum puté. Then we're having it with, of course, w when we have a steak sandwich, it's always nice to have it with potato chips. So if I ever you, have a sip of your wine, and then uh, go for it. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers. I guess it's wine before food today. Cheers. <laughs> Thank you, chef. Good pairing. Yummy. Hey, well, shut up. It's a dulo pala yung shut up. Here you go. Oh, wow. Wow. Carolyn. Come on, come, come, come. And then it's in your aircon. Mm -hmm. Really good, man. Get that into the crunch. Oh, 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 Looks amazing. Yeah. So, magic. That's the income. Go ahead, go ahead. This one here. And then one more. One more. Yeah, from my Okay. Eh, isisir muna natin yung beef para mag-lock in lahat na juices and mas maganda yung lasa. Pero dahil maganda yung karne, mabilis lang ito lumambot. Sir Carlos, thank you ha. Ito pa yung karne na binigay mo sa akin. Alam mo na kung sino ka.
Tapos pag nasir na lahat, uh, dito sa dito magluluto na ako ng sauce. Ah, ng mga gulay-gulay niya. We're gonna make it like a beef bourguignon, but Filipino style. Laurel. Tomato paste. Tomato paste palagi lulut. Cook it first. It's just it just tastes better. Mas mabango siya pag niluto mo yung tomato paste. This is beef stock. Fresh tomatoes. I'm gonna deglaze it with red wine. Kasi lahat ng mga dumidikit dito nandiyan yung lasa eh. So just deglaze it with a wooden spatula. Pag nagluto kayo sa bahay, yung mga dumidikit, try to add a cooking liquid so that you can remove all those goodness that's sticking on the pan. It's added flavor. Then, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna add it here. Mix. So this is gonna cook for about, I'd say two to three hours on a slow fire. Grilled leeks, grilled bell pepper, grilled carrots, grilled onions, lahat grilled para mabango. And again, the wine goes really well with grilled uh, ingredients. Hintayin natin kumulo or okay na to? Okay lang? Da, daming camera, da. daming decision. Oh, yan, maganda naman, ano, yun, no? Yan, buong bote. Over here, next course, no? Fish skewers. Anong fish yung gamit dyan? Ah, uh, bali tanigi. So, since we're making the fish skewers over there, I'm just gonna make a sort of like a garlic sauce. Slide ko na lahat. Careful. Careful lang. Then I'm gonna slowly cook it. And then I'm gonna flavor it with... Uh, I'm gonna flavor it with some coriander roots. Coriander. I'm just gonna add the lemongrass. Tapos, pag lumambot na to, ahun, tanggalin mo na yung lemon, tapos i-blender natin. Tapos ito na yung sauce ng isda. Okay, we shall do... We shall pour them some wine. Yes, absolutely. Who wants to go for the tomato? <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, you look better. Yeah, get, please get one. I'll squeeze a little bit of lemon. You want this one? Okay. 
Okay, whoever wants fish, this way. <laughs> it's a grilled tangige from Marv's. And then this is a just garlic confit with lemongrass, um, lemon, and bay leaf. All right, so just squeeze some lemon and go for it. <laughs> lemon is always nice when grilled. When you grill fish, mas maganda iyaw mo siya ng medyo malasado. Kasi ngayon, ito perfect. Kuha na siya, cook na siya. Kaya I'm only brushing it with some oil para hindi na maluto. Cheers. Cheers. So this, this dip, this garlic dip can go with everything actually. Anything grilled. grilled. Yeah, anything grilled. And it's so easy. Just cook it slowly in oil. Basically, you're making yeah low fire. Basically, you're making flavored garlic oil, and then just puree it. Meanwhile, here on this side, while they're eating there, Halo Halo Station is preparing. Hey guys, if you're ready, the Halo Halo station is open. Can you? Can I? Okay, so we'll yes. tell us about uh, this dish. This dish. Hello, hello. Mix, mix. Wow. <laughs> so it's basically what? How many ingredients is this? 16? 16. 16. Um, so we just want to get all those beautiful flavors James. together. Macapuno, nata, langka, uh, banana. I don't know that in Tagalog. Saba? No. Saba, saba. banana. Yeah. That's, the, that's the type of banana. Gulaman. Uh, what kind of banana? Sago. Uh, then we our secret ingredient that we do? Salted egg. Oh wow, salted egg. But you're not really going to taste it. It just kind of dissolves inside. So you get that balance of sweetness as well. And we've done the same thing with the cornflakes. We caramelized them and we put a bit of salt in them as well. Ah. And the chenglan, the ube milk, masarap. 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 There you go. Mm. <laughs> 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 Let's go. 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 Thank you. 
Ayun o, si Job natuto na rin. Kasing sarap ba yun kay Chef AJ? O mas masarap pa? Ha? Kasing sarap, Chef. Kasing sarap, good. Just throwing in everything. Jared Tomatoes. Wow. Okay. Good evening, everyone. What we have here is our last meal. Uh, last supper. Last supper, yeah. <laughs> of, supper. Of, uh, we, have, we had so many meals. So anyway, this is the last hurrah. Uh, we have here chicken in a sal, inihaw na baboy or uh, grilled pork belly. We have here a beef stew that's been cooked in our lovely Malbec. Wow, terrazas, terrazas. Grilled shrimp. Uh, have the chicken in a sal with our achara. Basically, it's pickled papaya. We have here a summer salad. Uh, just it's just topped with uh, grilled vegetables, uh, Parmesan cheese, olive oil. Then we made a pinoy carbonara, which is uh, with a smoked meat from Baguio. Then of course we have our garlic rice and uh, lots of wine. So yeah, guys, dig in. Thank you for everything, and uh, let's say grace. Lord, thank you for today and the friendships that's built, the connections, the food, the fellowship, and the time. Uh, thank you for the people who prepared it, and thank you for the wine that you've also given us to taste. Pray for a good meal tonight and an even better fellowship and a safe drive going home tonight. Yes, and thank you for and the thank weather. Thank you for the good weather. Yeah. So, that's the time. Yeah. We'd like also to talk about the wine. We have Nick Sandra here from yeah. West Ends, our boss. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Obviously, uh, grapefruit uh, belongs with uh, great wine. So, a quick introduction of Terrasas de los Andes. So, Terrasas de los Andes actually means Terraces of the Andes. Uh, it was a winery uh, founded in the early 90s by Moet Hennessy. Um, and it was a project that was given to a young French agronomist called Hervé Bernie Scott uh, to create a fine wine in Argentina. You know, before the, the 90s, Argentina was one of the biggest wine consumers in the world. Uh, but it was mostly table wine and uh, they knew they had more potential and of course Moet Hennessy is all about fine wine and, and, and champagne and he was given this mission. He arrived in Argentina having worked in the Loire Valley, having worked in Napa Valley, having worked in Australia and he spent six months with an old World War II altimeter exploring the foothills of the Andes and he came away from that research with two key convictions. <clears throat> One that to create fine wines in Argentina, you, you had to move up in elevation. You had to explore altitude. And the second conviction was that every varietal within Argentina had this optimal altitude in which it would produce its true character. And of course, we were one of those pioneers of creating uh, the terraces of the Andes, particularly focusing on Malbec, but also producing fantastic Chardonnays, fantastic Cabernet Sauvignons. Uh, and, you know, to this day, uh, Terrasas has played a pivotal role in creating high, al uh, high altitude viticulture and I think this shows through in the freshness and the elegance of the wines that we're having today and of course what a wonderful setting surrounded by mountains, surrounded by friends and partners and, and uh, fantastic uh, efforts of JP and his uh, team. So uh, a glass to all of you and uh, thank you very much. Have a glass. Cheers everybody. Cheers, 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 cheers. Thank you for this amazing Sunday. River Ranch, thank you. Thank you, River Ranch. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. 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 Ah, yeah. And this beef is amazing. That beef is uh, really good. It's like five hours stewing, right? Yeah. Oh. These five hour stews are always to die for. Remember, Mark? Yeah. Man, man, man against pork. <laughs> <laughs>